All right, guys. Hey, okay. I received a package last night at like 9.06 at night. And uh, I checked my Amazon list and it said it was delivered. I looked out in the driveway. Nothing there. Mark left this morning for work. And I happened to ask him, hey, did you come across the package? No, like not this again. So here we were either thinking someone stole a package or USPS is saying that they delivered it, but really delivering it the next day and they just check it off. I don't know if it has something to do with contracts with them. I don't know. But turns out it was on my front porch, which is kind of scary because we have a gate in the front of our property. So they had to go through that in order to deliver it to the front porch. Um, we, have, we have not even used our front door probably in the last six months because our house became so unlevel that our front door wasn't able to open. So we just got used to going outside the back door. Well, this morning, uh, I had to get something out of my truck and it just happened to be in the front of the house. And when I came back to the back of the house, I, I looked on the patio in the front and I'm like, there's a package. <laughs> so I have a package. I'm going to unbox it. And as I kind of suspected, um, I'm going to have to put this whole thing together, but it goes on the back of my UTV. That way I can get some work done. So I'm going to unpackage it, hopefully put it together, and then I can show you guys what it is. I had to take my work out into the sun. It got a little bit too cool for me. Whew. Those things weigh a ton. I am super winded. Um, yeah, it's not, it's not bolted together, but this is kind of an idea of what it's gonna look like based on the instructions here. So if you didn't uh, already guess, it is a traction rake. Let me put that on the back of our UTV, weigh it down with some uh, cinder block, and basically what it's going to do is going to scrape this whole area maybe even out here where we have holes and trees dug up and flatten it all out i uh, have too big of a property to be able to just do things by hand anymore and so having these tools like this just make the job just that much easier so i'm really looking forward to attaching that and getting that started because I think that's our next project if not that this right here but this part here just needs to be burned this is not a holy area this was all pretty much cleaned out from trees before we moved here so yeah over here is where we have a, those huge tree stumps in a pile there we got dips and divots and all kinds of stuff there we got to level all that out and uh this with all this running around with the UTV on our property back and forth, it's created some divots and stuff in the road, or in, not in the road, the driveway. So we definitely need to kind of rake it all out. And I think this will also help with that. So that is what the package was, guys. Hi, Tilly. All right, guys, it is connected. Woo! 
I did it. Now all I got to do is put some of those cinder blocks on it. And we can get to town on this. It doesn't look like much here. But these are pretty, I don't know if I can even, these are pretty big dips. We're going to have to do a lot of prep work. I can already tell. I took, I kind of took it for a little joy ride without the cinder blocks. But definitely going to have to do some prep work. We might have to go along and, oh, so many rocks though. I don't want to have to come in and take out every stinking rock because that would be an impossibility. I am so glad we're doing raised beds here, guys. There is no way with the amount of rock, big river rock in here, this whole area is covered in it. There's no way we could do in the ground planting. So we're definitely gonna have to prep, get this moved in and then take the, the drag over there and skim it all. Guys, I am so excited, this is one step closer. Oh, I love springtime for this. It makes me feel like I'm accomplishing stuff, huh, kimchi? Are we accomplishing stuff today? Huh? Yeah. I know I am. I don't know about you, dog. All right. So, that is it for today. We'll see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye.